Hi, I'm Minasan. Welcome back. We're finally going to be unboxing the Altair Haruka Nanares and Makoto Tachibana 1 7 scale figure. Holy crap, I'm so excited to finally have this. This got delayed twice. I was so worried on why are we getting delays, but it's so gorgeous. I mean, look at it. Oh, I'm sorry to open it. So let's get into it. I, I do like the box. The box is actually really pretty. Oh, there's even more on each side. But this is... It's not the most expensive Altair figure I've ever bought, but it, it's up there. It's one of those. But one of the reasons why you should always buy Altair figures is that they are always, always gorgeous quality. Never... We got instructions. They're Japanese, but there's still instructions on how this thing goes together. Okay. All right. There's still tape on this. Okay. All right. There we go. All right. Let's take Haruka out first. Oh, look at him. Look at him. All the detail. None. Like, come on, focus. All those details on his clothing. He's so pretty. And then we've got our bits of water. For their feet which are actually really cool. That's cool. Our weird two set base thing. I'm happy that it's separate because I am not going to be having these guys together because it doesn't make sense in my collection, but it, it looks cool. It's like this weird like ripple effect. It's really cool. It's pretty. Oh, I love the color. The color's cool. Oh, it's so cool. Look at that. It literally looks like I'm looking into a pool of water. That's cool. All right, now we got Makoto, the other baby boy. There he is. He's welcoming you. He's like, oh, hi. Oh, my goodness. Detail work. God darn detail. Because his clothing looks so real. It's it's beautiful. All right, so let's get this moved over here. All right, so these are the instructions. All right, so it looks like... Let me put you down right there. This base is Makoto's. So you put this... If this wants to fit, there we go. So you put it like that so that it's, it's very tight. And then as you guys can see, there's Makoto's foot. Foot just goes right in there or not. I'm being stupid there, there, there his foot. And he just sits like that. All right, let's put Haruka together. All righty. And Haruka's foot also has it. So we just go put the foot in like that. And then when you want these figures to be together, they sit like this. Oh. Makoto probably should be rotated a little bit, but hold on. And here they are. This is how they should look when they're put together. You can also uh, apparently rotate the water just a little bit more if you want them at a different angle. Probably get them a little closer together if you really want to. There's Makoto's face. His hands reaching out. 
I really love like the angles that they got on this because they look like they are in motion and that is amazing for a figure. And and I also am just like terrified that they're going to fall, but I know that they're not because they're re they're really put in there even on their one foot. But it's also just it's gorgeous. I love it. So much detail work, so much love and effort went into it. I'm okay with the delay. Might have taken a bit, but I'm glad that these are finally here. I'm glad that I can show you guys some more figures, because we're going to be getting... We've got a couple more. Uh, even for free, I've got uh, two special ones that I'm going to do a double unboxing, a live unboxing tomorrow. And then I've also got some new Q Nendroids that we got to do with some unboxings of. But anyway, guys, thank you so much for joining me today, and I will catch you all on the flip side. Bye, everyone.